how am I supposed to ride it on rainy days? And maybe I'll regret that. But this fucking thing flies. Do you think I'm kidding? And that's all uphill. It might not look like a hill here. That shit is all uphill. Touch of a button. Smaller than a banana. Banana for scale. Do you understand? This walk up this hill is usually so energy consuming, time consuming. I, I literally feel like I'm flying. <laughs> I literally feel like I'm levitating on thin air at no effort. Oh. I'm getting really used to the jerks and speed, so I'm not even falling off it. I don't even know what else to say. <laughs> and another thing about it, it's not like the unicycle thing. Those, those things are spectacles. This is very low profile, very relaxed, very chill. And look at that, I'm already right up on. <laughs> I'm already right up on my bus stop. No energy. That couldn't have been more than five minutes. I'm so excited about this thing. I turned a 10 or 12 minute speed walk into literally four minutes. Four minutes. <laughs> Didn't even like break a sweat or breathe heavy one time. Wobbled a bit. I won't lie. I was concerned at first about the size of it. You know, does size matter? And maybe for some people it does because, mind you, I'm only um, I'm only like a hundred and I'm only like 130 pounds, like literally. And then my bag is probably like 15. So I'm only putting like 150 on this thing. At the very most, at the very, at the very most, I'm only putting 150 pounds on this thing. The specifications say it's rated for uh, like 175, I think. So you might need a bigger one. But as a concept, oh my god, as a concept, it's incredible. Uh, that basically took no battery life. I'm not gonna ride it all the way to work because uh, obviously it's raining and. I don't want to damage it too much because I'm pretty sure that it's going to be I'm pretty sure you're not supposed to ride it in the rain I actually brought a little rag to dry it off but we'll see uh, after we get dropped off that's kind of the long walk and it's such a long walk that I have to take the early bus because if I don't take the early bus I'll get to work at like uh, five minutes after my shift starts, or maybe seven, depending on how fast I walk there. So, the real test is, uh, can this help me take the late bus? We'll see. Bro, this thing is literally dope as fuck. I'm losing my mind. Okay, part of me is like, fuck, I shouldn't be riding it in the rain because um, I don't want to damage it, but bro, it's just smashing. It's just smashing. And then I think to myself, this walk is like all uphill in the rain. Like that would suck. That would suck so bad. So it's only supposed to rain today. Hopefully this doesn't do too much damage. I was a little worried because of the size that it wouldn't be able to eat, you know, gravel and cracks in the road or whatever but bro it's <laughs> it's doing really really well like i'm extremely impressed uh so i don't know i, I took the bus uh those other four miles but i think i might try to no i can't ride it home because i can't ride it home today because i'm not going to charge it i'm going to see if it can do at least just the bus and the walk to and from. 
the bus. <laughs> I just want to see if it can do that on a full charge first. It's not really that slippery. Uh, if you if you know me, you already know I'm really bad at skateboarding um, and fall all the time. So this is this is feeling pretty good. This is feeling pretty good. What's up, machine? Another beautiful day. just been informed I'm getting a two dollar reduction in pay I'm worthless worthless and expected to move just as fast for less money I overperform at this job I got a 190 out of 90 197 Hear fucking Christmas music. In the rock, not yet, little Giddy up, giddy up, giddy up, you fucking workhorse until you die. <laughs> what an announcement. Comes out of nowhere. Peak pay is over. So that extra two dollars is all we're getting. Yeah. Not no more. I think what hurts the most. I don't really have any friends here. I don't make friends at work. But these supervisors, you know, I thought we were cool. Why would they keep this a secret from us? I don't know. It hurts. It hurts. It hurts to know that for these last three weeks, I've been joking and kidding and having fun and building. You know, connections with these people, and they've been lying to me. Where's the integrity? They could have communicated that. They could have said, hey, you know, we're gonna, <laughs> we're gonna cut your pay. I was wondering, because there's so much, even on the, even on like the first workstation, there's so much dust in this place. There's so much dust. And I kept asking people, why is there so much dust? I kept asking people who work there for fun. Why is there so much dust? Even now, three weeks, four weeks later, it's still mad dust. You guys gonna fire us? Don't fire me. It's a good job, it's a good job. Got me lying to my grandmother. I was talking to my grandmother yesterday. Okay. So yeah, I got a good job. Where? I just, I, don't, I just don't know if I can do it. <laughs> I've been over here, I've been laughing like the fucking Joker. <laughs> I've been talking to myself mad loud. They keep sending minders out here. Just come eavesdrop on my conversation with myself. <laughs> Man, this fucking Christmas music. I just don't know what to No, I do know what to tell you. I mean, it's, it was already on the table that I needed a new job because I don't, I'm not going to be living in Rialto forever. But, buddy, if ever I needed a sign to get the fuck on with my life, there it is. Mind blown. I used to move so fast, I can't move. I feel like I got a 35 pound coat on. I feel, I feel there's so much weight on me. <laughs> I feel like a fucking slave. I used to speed walk. Speed walk up and down the aisle, getting all my stuff. I can't speed walk no more. I just want to leave. The only thing keeping me from leaving right now is this motherfucking rain in outside. <laughs> I 
I'm a good worker. I'm a hard worker. I got a great attitude. Okay. I'm intelligent. I'm skilled. I'm dedicated. I'm fun. So I'm just like, what is this? They come to my desk, they tell me, hey, keep it up, good job. They be fist bumping me. Why are you fist bumping me? Fist bump me with the same hand that stabbed me in the back with. You know? Come on. It's, it's, it's hurtful. It's mind blowing. It's extremely demotivating above all else. It is, ex it is extremely demotivating. I can't even move. I, I can't even fucking move. I, I feel paralyzed. <laughs> I used to be a superstar over here. <laughs> I really was. Now I'm just, I'm just, now I'm just, oh, now I'm just preoccupied. Anyway, just wanted a live reaction to that one. <laughs> We're down the line. We'll check in later. I can't move. I can't do it. I'm, I'm, I'm getting shafted. I'm supposed to fucking wiggle. I'm supposed to wiggle while they fuck me in the ass. You know? <laughs> I'm supposed to take this. Lying down. You know, I'm just supposed to say, ah, uh, okay, thanks, boss. Thanks for telling me eventually. <laughs> I'm supposed to accept this. And be here tomorrow on time. Come on. Uh. I can hardly drag myself through. I just, I just want to leave. I just want to leave the place and just go enjoy my day. <laughs> it's like I'm still getting paid. <laughs> Bro, that's a huge That's a huge cut. People work at a job for years and years and years. You know, hoping, begging, praying, pleading, sabotaging others. Just so that they can get a one dollar raise or whatever, you know. And they're and they're taking that off. They're taking two dollars off. I'm just supposed to not give a fuck. Is is it supposed to go over my head? You know. I can't do the math. <laughs> I'm just like, why couldn't they tell us that? They could have told me. I could have, 